Hi, I'm Chris Meyer with the Center for Translational Data Science at the University of Chicago. I'm excited to introduce to you Gen3, which is an open source software platform that supports the emergence of healthy data ecosystems by enabling the creation and interoperation of cloud-based data resources, including data commons, data meshes, and analysis workspaces. In line with the NIH strategy for expediting the translation of research results to improvements in human health by making data more accessible, Gen3 aims to accelerate and democratize the process of scientific discovery by making it easy to manage, analyze, harmonize, and share large and complex data sets and the cloud. Gen3 was designed around FAIR principles, such that any data resources created using a Gen3 platform will by default have many of the desirable characteristics of a FAIR data repository. Specifically, Gen3 aims to make datasets and data management and analysis resources findable, accessible, interoperable, and reusable. First, Gen3 assigns data file objects and structured metadata unique persistent identifiers. The Gen3 file indexing service is cloud agnostic, meaning it works on any cloud infrastructure, and it assigns file objects persistent unique data identifiers called GUIDs. So even if a file moves physical locations, the identifier that researchers use to access the file remains the same. When data is created, modified, or moved, it is versioned in order to track data provenance, and snapshots of databases can be created after each new release in order to track changes over time and revert changes if necessary. Second, Gen3 promotes dataset discovery by defining and describing datasets using metadata. Gen3's metadata import and export services support harmonization of ingested data by utilizing a graph-like relational data model that clearly defines data at a granular level. Gen3's query services also use that data model to empower complex queries of the data for filtering via faceted search and cohort building. Data dictionaries leverage standard ontologies in the field and are typically created collaboratively by a working group or committee. Gen3 also has a schemaless metadata service that allows datasets to be described using flexible custom attributes and tags. This schemaless metadata service supports the building of Gen3 data meshes, where dataset metadata is aggregated across resources that may employ different data models. Gen3 data meshes empower discovery of datasets across an entire data ecosystem using keyword search and facilitate download or export of data to analysis workspaces. In a Gen3 system, access to data and computational resources is achieved through an attribute-based access control policy engine. Experts can be assigned curation level permissions to the data to provide quality assurance and expert curation services. Researchers can be given access to workflow execution services and other powerful analysis workspaces, while the general public can be given read-only permissions to open data sets while being restricted from controlled access data to provide free, easy, and equitable access to data. Furthermore, Gen3 environments can also be run entirely in a virtual private cloud to prevent unauthorized access and limit where data can be accessed and analyzed. The Gen3 platform makes it easy to provide broad and measured reuse of data through providing unique IDs to datasets and publication metadata that includes citation information and licenses for reuse. Furthermore, built-in tools allow data commons operators to prompt users to register or accept data use agreements prior to accessing data. Gen3 systems can be continuously audited by cloud monitoring services like Datadog, which can provide information about what data are accessed and by who in order to protect sensitive data sets and identify unauthorized attempts to access data or resources and block malicious IP addresses. Finally, Gen3 has been designed to facilitate interoperation between various data commons, data meshes, and data resources. Unlike many other data platforms, Gen3 services are open source and provide open APIs that can receive and respond to API requests in standard formats and have no proprietary components. The Gen3 team at the Center for Translational Data Science at the University of Chicago encourages researchers and developers to review the code base of the Gen3 software stack, submit feature requests, and contribute to the project by joining our growing community. 
To learn more about Gen3, please visit our website at gen3.org and make sure to visit the community page. Thanks so much for listening, and we hope to hear from you in our Slack channel or forum. Happy data wrangling!